Welcome to another Mondays with the Mayor. I'm Mayor Clay Walker of the Denali Borough. And today is Thursday, June 4th. It's been a little while since our last Mondays with the Mayor. And boy, we've been busy with a lot of different um, developments here. I wanna share, share a significant one with, with you. Uh, and thanks for watching, thanks for staying tuned. The borough has been deeply impacted um, by the coronavirus as we talked about along the way. And thankfully here in June, we still have no positive cases, but the total collapse of the biggest industry in the borough, the visitor industry, has had massive you know, impacts and businesses and individuals have had massive losses uh, due to the COVID-19. And frankly, it pains me to see such low levels of activity here in the borough on these beautiful June days. I was thinking back, it's my 29th June in the borough and, and um, certainly never seen any level of activity this low. Probably goes back to the mid 70s in terms of level of activity. Um, but, um, you know, we're really grateful for the federal assistance through the CARES Act and very grateful that Governor Dunleavy and the Alaska State Legislature committed uh, such significant amounts of the CARES funding to municipalities to address the COVID-19 impacts and to support our response. The Denali Borough will receive in total uh, $3.8 million. We've been working on this one feverishly for, for weeks here, and, um, and we did just receive our first installment in those payments that will go through October. And the monies do need to be spended by, expended by December 30th. And, um, <clears throat> and one use that is prohibited is to backfill the borough general fund all the revenues that we will not receive due to the collapse of the industry, all that overnight accommodations revenue that will be lost this year cannot be um, replenished with these monies. But we can put these monies to good use in our community, and that's really what we've been focused on. I wanna share some news with you. Um, as, as we've been working hard to develop these plans and programs, and with the Assembly and Finance Committee approval, We've, we've prioritized the support of local businesses and local nonprofit organizations. And tomorrow, Friday, June 5th, we're gonna go live with, with new grant applications for these programs. Um, and information can be found on our website, so please do go to our website and check out those applications. Now, the sums that are, that'll be available um, in these grants will not come close to what the federal government uh, was able to do with the PPP program or what the state can provide through its Alaska CARES program. But the Denali CARES program, as we're calling it, can provide that additional level of support for businesses uh, which have been impacted and, for, and to local nonprofits as well. The road to recovery will be challenging for all of us, for everybody, but we're all gonna work together and work hard because we all care and that's what we're calling the program, Denali Cares. And I do want to share um, the great, uh, this great poster put together by the Tri-Valley Student Council thanking the Denali Borough Assembly for supporting the community throughout this difficult time. We are here to support you because you always support us. Much love from the Tri-Valley Student Council. That's every one of the student council members showing they care. So. If you're a nonprofit organization, a small business in the Denali Borough, check out our Denali Cares program, launching tomorrow. And let's get through this together. Thanks everybody, take care. Mm -hmm.